Okay, in this video we will learn how to import the, the AutoCAD file uh, as a reference model to Tecla. So, in the previous in the previous uh, video, you have learned how to open a new file in Tecla, a new mo new model, and uh, we have opened already this file that is uh, the drawing provided by the engineer. So now to import this file, this uh, file we need to put we can import the old drawing together but it will not be helpful it will be annoying so we'll just import for now this grid this grid with the columns as you see here the columns are shown so importing the grid and uh, importing this view will be very helpful for us to start the project so first to import this uh, drawing we have a couple of things to keep in mind so the first thing the first thing we need to do is to copy this drawing this part of the drawing here to Tecla to, an, to another uh, AutoCAD file so we're gonna do this by creating a new file new AutoCAD file okay click here go to AutoCAD new AutoCAD file okay and then copying this view from here okay first I will just uh, create something here uh, we have here a timer in Tecla you can download this from uh, from uh, with the warehouse uh, this timer is just to create we'll add here importing importing uh, from AutoCAD okay I'll just write it faster import I'll just name it reference model and click OK now we have a new timer I just put this timer so we can know how much time this creating this new creating this reference model took okay now so we are here in a new drawing so we are copying this one from here and putting in this new this new drawing i just select the this view and create click ctrl c on the keyboard and you can read here copy clip and the number of object found and going to the new for new file and control v we press control v on the keyboard and here uh, i you click 0 comma 0 comma 0 as it's shown here you see so the new reference the new model will be uh, inserted in this uh, coordinates the 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 model will be inserted at this point 0 0 0 and then zoom enter you click on the keyboard z enter and e enter to extend to the model okay so this is our model. There is some some stuff we bring brought with us here. So we we'll just delete them. Delete. And then again, we'll move this one. We'll move this model. Move, and we will choose this one to this point here, the intersection of the axes one and a, to be our uh, uh, reference point uh, with the coordinate zero zero zero. Okay, zero comma zero comma zero again. We have set the new coordinate again to the uh, 0, 0, 0 location and now here uh, we are sure that uh, this point is uh, at the coordinate uh, 0, 0, 0. and now uh, we will make sure that the units are correct we just go to dimension linear click from here to here and then you know you see the units is correct it's five thousand five meter or five thousand millimeter so this unit is correct now one another thing to keep in mind is uh, that this reference model uh, this reference model should be should stay with the model uh, if you're sending the model to someone and you want to open the model it's preferable that this model stay within the model so to do this uh, uh, what I what I uh, do usually I open the model folder from Tecla now we are in Tecla again and you go here to the file and open model folder okay so this is the model folder of uh, the project in Tecla I create a new folder and create and call it reference models okay now we have a new folder in here called reference model I just double click and we have this new folder and just put all the reference models in this folder so if i send the model for a client or anyone i can the reference models will stay with it 
and now to save this file this AutoCAD file to this small this uh, folder I just copy this link here you see I click here and this is, it will be highlighted I copy and then I go here and save Control S I click on Control S and the new mod and I'm saving and just click paste here and I'm pasting the new location enter now I am in the reference model in the folder uh, in the model folder of the Tecla file now I name I will name this one plan plan view plan I'll just name it plan okay and save okay but most importantly when important to Tecla is make sure the units are in AutoCAD set to millimeters if you're importing from millimeters so you write units here and enter and then you see here it's unit list. so it should be in units this is a big it's very important or it will, it will not import the model in millimeter and you'll have uh, problems so okay now the units is set to millimeters I save again control s and then I it's done the reference model is ready to be imported the, the AutoCAD file is ready to be imported to Tecla okay so I'll leave this one. I'll, I'll exit this file I don't need to be in it anymore so here I click control P and then I see the plan view I go here the reference model as you see and then uh, add a new model here you can drag and drop so it's very easy you go open the folder where we have put the file plan drag and drop so it's here and we add the file and uh, now as you can see uh, you need a little bit of time is a tecla structure will ask you that the objects are placed outside the work area because the file is bigger than work area so we just say expand and as you can see now uh, this is the model that we had the AutoCAD file inserted as a reference model so uh, if you cannot if you when you put the mouse above this reference model it will be highlighted so if you want don't want to be to be able to click on the reference model because you don't want to uh, move it by mistake or something so you just go here as you can see here and uh, se select reference and you can click on this icon here to disable uh, to disable being able to select this reference model now we cannot select the reference model if we put the mouse above it it will not be highlighted so now this is uh, now we have uh, learned how to insert the reference model uh, to Tecla Thanks for watching and uh, don't forget to uh, subscribe to my page and uh, watch the next video you will learn how to uh, change the grid to be uh, similar to the grid of uh, AutoCAD file uh, and then uh, you can watch all the videos you will learn all how to create the full project we'll, I will create the full project here on Tecla uh, in the, on this channel so you will be able to learn how to create a project from A to Z. Thank you and uh, have a good day.